now let's shift focus over to Indian politics. As Sadhvi Pragya was named the BJP's candidate for the Bhopal Lok Sabha seat this week, pitting the Malegaon blast accused against the Congress's Digvijay Singh. It's created a storm in political circles already. Now the statement we are about to show you is a hugely controversial comment about the death of a former Mumbai ATS chief, Hemant Kakare. Pragya Thakur commented today that the former Mumbai anti-terrorist squad chief, Hemant Kakare, who died during the Mumbai terror attacks, had treated her very badly and died because of his actions. Kakare was killed by Pakistani terrorists and received the Ashok Chakra posthumously. Listen in to what Sadi Pragya had to say. The 49-year-old right-wing activist spent nine years in jail on terror charges. She was arrested in the case shortly after the blast. Investigators said the explosives were stored in a bike belonging to her. And on Thursday, as opposition parties vehemently criticized the BJP over her nomination from the Bhopal seat, the charges against her under the stringent Maharashtra Control of Organized Crime Act or the MCOCA were dropped and she was acquitted. But she still an accused in the terror case charged under the Unlawful Activities Prevention Act. The Bhopal seat has been controlled by the BJP for nearly three decades and her candidature is a gamble for the BJP. And for more details on this news story, let me also bring you more perspective from our political editor, Mr. Karthike Sharma, who just joins me live from New Delhi in just a bit. This is indeed a deeply shocking statement coming in from Pragya Singh Thakur, who's almost spoken about how she wished for the destruction of the former ATS chief, Hemant Karkare. For more details on this news story, 